In this video, we will be studying the effects of inflation or the problems related to inflation. Now, in the previous videos, we have studied about what is inflation. So, inflation is the rise in the general prices. Let's suppose your uh, apple costed you rupees 50 per kg, but now the price of apple is around 120, 150 rupees per kg. So, this is the rise in the price of apple and this is due to inflation this is known as inflation so what are the effects or the problems that are generated in the economy due to inflation so first is your inflation hinders the process of growth see i've told you earlier that in the developing country which is growing the inflation is the major problem. The inflation is the root cause that affects the growth and development of that country. So rapid increase in the prices hinders the process of growth as it raises the cost of production. Though the wages uh, rises, cost of raw material rises, rising the cost of investment. So uh, you need more and more capital for the same output you used to produce if there is inflation right so infl uh, as a you know entrepreneur you do not have capital to invest that much so what it will do you will reduce your production earlier you used to produ uh, produce let's say 300 ton of uh, units now you will produce 200 ton of units because you do not have money to use more factors of production so in this way inflation hinders the process of growth adverse effect on the people with fixed income see when there is inflation in the economy your income is fixed right this will reduce your purchasing power this actually reduces your real income let's suppose you have rupees 40 with you this is your income cost of one banana is rupees 4 now if the cost of one banana increase to 5 here you can buy 10 bananas but if it increased to 5, you will only be able to uh, uh, buy 8 bananas in rupees 40. Just because there is rise in the prices of the commodity or a rise in the prices of the goods and services, but there is no rise in the income of the consumer. In that case, it has an adverse effect on the people with the fixed income. Third is increase in the cost of product projects inflation means increase in the price of goods and services so your factors of production land labor capital and entrepreneur you give wages rent you know factor factor payments you make those due to inflation those factor in uh, inputs have become costlier so there is increase in the cost of project Earlier you used to complete in the projects let's say in rupees 1 lakh but as the factor input costs have increased you will be able to complete the project in 1.5 lakh according to the rate of inflation. So it increases the cost of your projects. Fourth, adverse impact on balance of payment. See, if there is inflation in your economy, which means your domestic goods have uh, are have become costlier, right? If your domestic goods have become costlier, it will affect your exports in the international markets. Just because international market used to buy your goods, let's say at rupees 10 per unit. But now, due to inflation, your domestic goods have increased to rupees let's say 15 per unit now the international market will buy your goods at rupees 15 per unit but 
do you think they will buy at a 15 per unit on such a high price like 50 uh, percent increase in the uh, price of the good no and if they will buy they will buy less amount so in that case this will ha reduce the exports in the market in the international market your domestic product will become more costly in the international market so international market will find out its substitute in this way, this will ha have an adverse Im impact on your balance of payment as your exports will be less. Fifth, wage price spiral. See, your price of factors of production increases. But wages remain same. Ultimately, what happens due to this? Your real income reduces, or you can say your purchasing power reduces. Right? So this is another problem of inflation sixth is your inequality see inflation increases the gulf between rich and poor in due to inflation rich become more richer and the poor become more Order. Seventh is your economic stagnation. See what happens? Inflation lowers your purchasing power. I've told you in the case of banana in the previous slide. So having sent bulk of their income on the necessities, you will see if you are income and moreover the income is constant their income is fixed but the prices have increased of the goods so what you will do you will spend bulk of your income on the necessity goods whereas you will spend less income on your luxury or comfort goods so this shrink the market of the secondary and tertiary sector of production especially your comforts and luxury goods so this reduces the growth in these sectors this reduces the economic growth it is your impact on FDI. FDI is foreign direct investments. Foreign direct investment means that companies from foreign come into your domestic country and invest. They open up their branches. They do joint ventures, they do give franchises. So these are all the examples of FDIs. So if I talk about McDonald's, McDonald's had opened up their uh, many franchises in India. If I talk about business BPOs, we've heard about the call centers, US call centers, UK call centers. Why have they chosen India as the place to uh, have their operations? See, just because in India they get Lay, uh, employees at a very low rate moreover investment is low moreover purchase uh, the land cost is very low so this is the reason they have chosen India for this but let's suppose if there is inflation inflation means increase in the price of input there will be increase in the price of land there will be increase in the price of wages so what happens now the inputs, the raw material or the inputs or the labor in India has become more costlier. So it will if impact the foreign direct investment. They will not come and they will avoid investing in India just because the cost of inputs has increased. Mind this speculation and hoarding. So speculation and hoarding are the dangerous consequences of inflation. Traders make speculative investment on inventory stock. Current supplies are reduced, scarcity is compounded and the state of social unrest is created in the economy. Now if there is inflation, 
what these producers and every everybody do they hold the stock they do not supply in the market the demand is there in the market but there is no good so what it will uh, so what will happen it will increase the price of good so they hold the good in order to increase the price in the market so that they will sell at the higher prices if the price in the market rises so this is another problem which is faced during due to inflation i hope you like our video please download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us